things we can't always going to remember. And within everything you're doing, there's a way of being able to find out if you are growing, if you're getting better, right? And challenging yourself. You remember said, like once you learn how to compete against yourself, competing against anybody else is going to be easy. Once you learn how to compete against yourself. So right now in the gym, the highest we've got is six in a row. Those of you who haven't got to three in a row yet, like come on. You gotta think about three in a row with baby steps. Baby steps. You're, you should be looking for 10 in a row, 15 in a row, 20 in a row. Because really it's, it's the same, you're taking the same shot. You're taking the same shot, the same mechanics, same rhythm, same form. So in your head you might think, oh my gosh, 10 in a row, oh my gosh, what a big number, 20 in a row. But when you really, really think about it, if you're repeating the same thing over and over again, same mechanics, same form, then why can't you get 10 in a row? Why can't you get 20 in a row, 30 in a row, 40 in a row, 15 in a row? Why not? It's all mechanics, right? It's all repeating the same motion over and over, same rhythm, same rhythm. So do, don't ever be satisfied with making one shot every now and then missing and maybe making two in a row for my man. That's baby food. Go get that 10 in a row, go get that 20 in a row. Fix your rhythm, fix your mechanics to, to allow you to be able to do that. Keep challenging yourself, keep trying to grow. All right, all right, we're gonna play a little bit um, out of that dribble.